This video will show you the difference between using the additive and subtractive methods of building a part. For example, suppose we want to create a two-step staircase shape. First, we'll do this using the subtractive method. Draw a rectangle. Set the vertical and horizontal dimensions to 4 inches. Set the Z value to 2 inches. Click the pyramid button to see the 4 by 4 by 2 block. Now draw a rectangle of half width. To remove material from the original shape, set the Z value to negative 1. Click the pyramid button to see the three-dimensional view of the part. Notice that material has been removed to create the staircase shape. Now we'll make the step using the additive method. Let's delete the existing design and draw a 4 by 4 rectangle again. Set the Z value to 1 inch this time instead of 2 inches. Click the pyramid button to see the 4 by 4 by 1 block. Now draw the smaller rectangle as before. To add material, set the Z value to positive 1. Click the pyramid button and note that we have the same shape as before, but constructed using the additive method. The additive and subtractive methods can be combined in one design. Use whichever method is most convenient for your shape.